How's it going, everyone? And welcome back to a very special YouTube video. In this video, it's going to be the final one that I'm going to be doing for Nostalgia Week. I didn't do as many Nostalgia Week episodes as I would have liked to, but we're going to top it off with a revisit back to the map packs. I completed all the map packs in 2016 uh, during the 2.0 update, and uh, I actually, it made me better at the game. I kind of, I kind of enjoyed doing them. A lot of people don't like these levels, but overall, I had a pretty good experience with them, even though there are some definite stinkers and there's some ones that were updated to be super hard and the rating is all wrong. And some of the ones that were updated were updated and they just have like one part in them that's way harder than the rest and it's really annoying. So what I did is I took to Twitter and I asked you guys, what do you think are the worst map pack levels? And I'm gonna play them in a video. So there were a few people that said the UFO pack was not good, but I actually really like the UFO pack. Like all the UFO pack is, is it's, this is UFO Geist. It's like Polar Geist, except you're a UFO instead of a cube, like the entire way. Like, how can you not love this? Isn't it fun? I mean, some people, some people might not if they're, if they don't like the UFO gameplay, but I thought these levels were fascinating. I thought they were interesting. They weren't like overly difficult. I really enjoyed doing them. I enjoyed most of the map pack levels. Like I said, the only ones I didn't enjoy were the ones that weren't their actual rating and ones that had been like insanely buffed in very weird ways. Um, like PG Club Step. Oh my God, PG Club Step. PG Club Step is one of those levels that always changes. Like before I did that level in uh, the map packs, it was uh, actually really easy. And then for some reason, it got buffed like there's the mini ship part like halfway through the level it got buffed and it was insanely hard and then i beat it as it was buffed and then i made a video about that and then the creator nerfed it again after i made that video <laughs> like oh that level's gone through like so many buffs and nerfs you know like you never know what state it's gonna be in but we're certainly gonna check out a pg club step because that is one that was you know, put in the map packs as a kind of a challenging level and got changed to be ridiculously hard and then back to easy again. And just who knows what state it's in, you know? Who actually knows? But all I gotta say about this so far is, my God, the UFO packs are so much fun. How can you not like them? There's multiple people that said they didn't like the UFO levels. They're beautiful. Okay, multiple people said that time is eco was a bad level so we got to go for it time is eco i don't even remember this one there's a lot of levels i just don't don't understand so i mean what's wrong with this level <laughs> why don't people like it it looks kind of chill you know like it doesn't look that bad it's so normal and it's so easy to sight read like some of them are really hard to sight read but this one's chill uh okay a lot of people are saying they didn't like it because there's too many triple spikes so i've come across like uh four triple spikes so far i think let's 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 keep track five <laughs> five, five triples, six triples. Okay, I mean, I get it. If there's a lot of triples, if people are good at triples, six triples. Oh, seven triples. How many more are there gonna be? <laughs> Eight triples. Okay, I, I get it. If you're not good at triples. Nine triples, 10 triples, 11 triples. <laughs> What the F? That's okay. I don't like that fake. That's dumb. Well, okay. You got me again with the same thing immediately after. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Nice and chill. Nice and chill for the rest of the level. I don't want to play this level anymore. Another triple. I don't know how many triples we're at, but it's quite a lot. It's quite a lot. Ah, that fake you don't hit. Come on. I was ready to hit all those fakes. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm going. I'm flying, I'm focusing, I'm concentrating so hard. There's been like almost 20 triple spikes so far. <laughs> that's been, that's quite a lot of triple spikes, actually. <laughs> okay, God, whoa, dude, no! Oh, that jump is awful. It changes and then you gotta jump like right away. Oh man, yeah, there's been like almost 20 triple spikes by that point. <laughs> okay, I get it. I get why people hate it. I'm not a big fan. I don't think I hate this level. I, I don't like it either. You know, I'm not going to fire up this level and be like, Whoa, nostalgia. Let's have a great time, boys and girls. <sighs> oh, my God. Ah! Oh. 
<laughs> Finally. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, okay, I mean, level's not bad, um, but there's definitely just some frustrating moments where like a portal will switch and you got to jump right away uh, and some weird timings to line up and a ton of triple spikes which i understand why for someone that comes into this game wants to do the map packs finds a six star level called time is eco and finds like 20 triple spikes is like oh it's a little frustrating if you're not good at them i am indifferent to it i don't not like it i don't like it just uh, you know just something to get through but i get why people don't like this okay so another one that i saw pop up multiple times was dynamic on track which uh I don't know why this one's on here. Like, I don't quite remember it. Oh, no. Wow, you have to jump late there. It might be a bug, though, like a 240 hertz bug. At least I can get around it by jumping late, but <laughs> yikes. So why do people not like this level? This is just like, it's just like a buffed back on track, but at two times speed. Um, cause I don't remember this one being like a hassle. Like, there was this one I remember, which was like, a, it was a can't let go V2. Not the Neptune one, but it was like a different one that was like super annoying. But this is, I mean, this is super chill. Why is, uh, why is this on here? Oh, uh, oh, so you just fall here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You just fall. It doesn't look like you do. But I guess you are going at a uh, two times speed. Um, let's do this. Okay. Dynamic on track. Why do people not like this level? It's so normal and unassuming. It's not like, it's not cheap in any way. Time is eco is way harder than this and like way more annoying. Like there isn't any, oh, what? There isn't many like annoying parts in this, you know? Although I guess this three times speed could get a little, it could get a little deadly. I could see it getting deadly, yeah. Uh... Oh boy. Yeah, what? What is all that writing? It's so messy. I don't remember that being there. <laughs> is there gonna be like some weird troll at the end or something that I'm aware of? I feel like I'm really close to. What? I don't get it. I don't get it. Dynamic on track. Pretty chill. I actually kind of liked it how it just like it's like back on track, but it just keeps on getting faster and faster. I like that one. So this is a level that kept on popping up too. the description is just lol called theory of relativity. Like this popped up multiple times. This one in square adventure, like square adventure. I'm going to have to dig up somewhere as well. So let's uh, let's do this. Um, it looks like this one was updated or something. <laughs> Why is this? This is pretty chill. You got to go like underneath there. Okay, <laughs> it's so, it's an absolute mess to read. Okay, yeah, I guess I kind of get it. I get it. It's it's like deadlocked. This must have gotten updated. Oh, oh my god! This is gonna be one of those ones that's just absolutely impossible to sight read, isn't it? Oh, why are you put me? Ah, oh boy! Oh, you so you jump over that? Oh, holy shoot, dude! No. You find hidden. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Is this like... <laughs> oh, yeah. Da, 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 da. Did I just turn into a UFO? <laughs> okay, it's not so bad. I was going to say it's not so bad anymore, but... <laughs> no, no way. Oh, that, that's, that's a lot of off-screen stuff going on. You jump there, and then it's just... Oh, oh. Oh. I break it. What? Oh, okay. That's a ship. Okay, I'm going the up path. Okay, I think I kind of... Oh! Dun-dun-dun-dun-dun-dun-dun-dun. <laughs> ah! You gotta dodge that key? Oh, my God. Whoa. I, have, I like mystery piano. Hell yeah, embrace the mystery piano. Oh yes. Oh, embrace it. Mystery piano, mystery. Mystery piano, mystery piano. <gasps> I totally understand why people have a problem with this level. Wow. This level actually has like some pretty good moments once you learn it. Um, it's not so bad, but it's it's super learny, and uh, I find that some of the timings are really awkward, and a lot of the gameplay, like the points that will kill you, are ones that happen like off screen, like it thrusts you upwards, and you can't see like up here, like you hit that, you can't see what's above you, 
and you can't see like the actual gameplay that you're playing, you know? Because it's just a bunch of stuff that happens like th this. Ugh. And uh, that's frustrating, you know, when you die. So I get people's like uh, problems with this level. I, I, I totally understand it. I think it's like not so bad once you memorize it. And if more of the gameplay was just like on screen and there were less fakes, it would just be like better overall. Um, but it's still it's still decent. Like now that I've like learned the level, it's still decent. But like, yeah, like the, the off ugh, all the off screen shenanigans are like really annoying, right? Where you can't see where you're going and you just have to trust the level. I really hate that in level. Well, I think it's decent, but I understand why people wouldn't like it. <laughs> like that fast transition after the ship part where like you got to do a bunch of jump orbs and like there's objects moving everywhere, like the platforms. I had to go and practice that again. Uh, I, I get why people don't like this level. It is it is way harder than a nine star like this. The flying section with all the ships in the way. Like, that's 100% demon difficulty, whether it's, like, easy or medium. It's pretty tight. Even me, I was like, whoo, wow. Like, I felt uncomfortable going through there, uh, thinking I was going to die. I get it. Okay. I thought it was a decent level, though. Don't like it. Don't hate it. Um, actually, I liked a lot of the gameplay. I think a lot of it is good. It's just, like I said, the problems are is... It's way unbalanced. A lot of the gameplay is like off screen, like off screen jump orbs and stuff, which is just inherently annoying, right? Okay, so so many people have said Square Adventure is one that they didn't like. Like, I just don't even remember this one. Why would people not like this? This seems easy, right? Easy. Yeah? What's wrong with Square Adventure? It's just we're a square. We're going on a little adventure, guys. Jumping over some easy to jump stuff, right? Like, what's, what's wrong with this? I don't... Oh... Yeah, I mean, I can see that. The multiple way thing where it looks like you gotta go one way. It's like a coin path style, but when you take the wrong way, you die. Ah, uh, I mean, I get it. Oh, oh, yeah, it's getting a little harder. I guess, but so far, it's still, like, very sight-readable, you know? Oh, oh, oh! Okay, we gotta turn off V-Sync. Oh. Ah. Yeah, I definitely had to turn off V-Sync for that. And get it back to, uh, <laughs> wait, wait, what? Okay, that ending is weird, dude. Oh, come on. Remember what I practiced? Because you have to practice this, honestly. It's, it's bananas. Yeah. Come on. Yes, go, go, go. Woo -hoo -hoo! Doesn't matter. Hit both the speed changes. That's how cool we are. We can go through this fast. Yeah, okay. I honestly, I understand why people don't like that because the end is really wild. There's multiple paths you can take and it's way harder than I would say four stars. The ending portion anyways. And it's a big jump up from all the levels you've probably played up until that point. Um, but I still thought it was decent. It wasn't, wasn't bad. No reason to... I don't hate it, you know? Okay, one level that keeps on coming up as well is Corrupted Kingdom. I seem to remember this being really difficult and very, like, memorization heavy. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I remember this one. Um, oh my god. Let's see if it's hard as I remember. Like, as soon as I heard the name Corrupted Kingdom, I was like, yeah, that sounds really difficult. Yeah, that's really hard. That's... That flying is way harder than eight stars is all I gotta, all I gotta say. Oh boy. Yeah, that's tight. It's tight, and I don't know where I'm going. I, I'm I'm so lucky. Oh my god! Wow, it's the same problem I had with Theory of Relativity. Is there's there's so many inputs that are just off screen, and you can't see what you're doing. And it's, it comes down to pure memorization. And this flying is that is so, just way harder than date stars. Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm surprised I was able to read that. Okay. 
Do, 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 do. I can, yes, I can read that. Nice, nice, nice. Not so bad all of a sudden, or is it? Woo! <laughs> wow! That flying is insane, dude! Holy crap! Eight stars? Are you kidding me? Hey, luckily, I went into practice mode. Those spikes there are a bit, a bit trolly. Wow. Okay, the level was fine until this part. I mean, it was really hard and way, like, underrated. But this is stupid. That jump is so dumb. Okay, I turned off vertical sync to see if this was like a 60 hertz thing or a 240 hertz bug. Yeah, actually, that jump is so much easier on 60 hertz. It's basically just broken on 240 hertz. You just jump too high. I got it. Yeah, I shouldn't die now. Okay. I had to change it to uh, 60 hertz, though, for sure. I had to take V-Sync off just because that one jump was extremely hard and busted on a 240 hertz. Um, but this level, you know, now that I've practiced it a bit, it's actually, like, pretty fun. There's a couple, like, really annoying bits, though. Uh, just a couple annoying bits. They're not super annoying. It's just way underrated. Like, this is not eight stars. This is, like, medium demon. That flying is hard hard right so when you come to this level in the map packs and you're like oh eight stars like it, it's deceiving it's extremely way more difficult uh than it's supposed to be which i don't know if it was buffed or not maybe it was buffed or something who knows okay so hyper ice jumper is a level that's popped up a few times as well um so i just want to check it out uh, i don't know if i'm going to complete it in normal mode because i don't have enough time i spend a lot of time on corrupted kingdom <laughs> but why is this level annoying this just looks like jumper you know Bum, 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 bum. Oh, oh, oh! What? You actually have to, you have to jump onto that, don't you? So you're, no, what? Uh, this might be impossible on 240 hertz for some reason. Okay, let's try this again, 60 hertz. No, it's still jank, what? A uh, what? <laughs> How do you do that? Okay, it wasn't just my 240 hertz. V-Sync is off for me now. N no way, no way. How, how in the world? Come on. There, there's, something I, there's something I'm clearly missing here. Okay, did something change in the game that, like, broke this level? Because, like, this is... I can't figure out how to do this. I'm on 60 hertz now. There shouldn't be any bugs. This level was clearly made on 60 hertz, right? Like, I don't know how you get over there. Guys, this level must have broke. Like, I just took a look at uh, one of Darnik's old videos. And, like, all he does is he just falls, like, hits the jump pad. And then hits these. And then you go. Like, something broke this level in, like, an update. Is There's actually an impossible level in the map pack. I can't do it. There's no way. It's not happening. This level's actually broken. That's the first level I've come to today that I understand people's frustration on because that is insanely broken and must be really frustrating uh, to not even be able to beat that level. Even like on some devices on 60 hertz, right? That's that's bananas. The last level we're going to try today is a level that is infamous. Um, I've already talked about it earlier on the video. This level keeps on getting nerfed, buffed, nerfed, buffed. And when I played it, when I beat it, it was my final level I had to do before I'd completed every single level in the map packs. And it was in its, like, one of its hardest states it had ever been. Let's let's see what the state of the level is. By the way, there's all these faces in the level, like, when you die, it's like, ooh, oh, you died, oh, and, like, it drives you crazy. Like, seriously, it drives you up the wall. Like, it's just, ugh, it's the, it's the worst thing seeing that. Oh my god, no. There's all the fakes and the, the stupid faces when you die. <laughs> no. Oh no. It's just memorization hell. Did you see that? It's it's memorization hell. Oh man, look how hard that flying is. <laughs> Oh man, yeah, this level's something else. This isn't even like the hard flying part either. Like the hard flying part just comes later, which is... <laughs> uh. Is this death? That's, it's just, uh, it's just, uh, such a long death, just kill me. 
Like, what is this part? You just, like, jump... You don't even hit the pink jump board. You just, like, jump down. Wait, what? Oh, my God. Look at this. Oh, my God. So many fakes, dude. I don't think I'm going to beat this level today. I just, like, wow. I mean, just, like... <laughs> Just practicing this, it's bringing me its bringing me back to a really bad place when I was playing this level. Oh my god, it's so not fun. Okay, so this was the really hard part before. It looks to me like it's nerfed a little bit because like as you got into here, as you got into that place, those like spikes that are kind of faded out, those used to be like actual spikes. So it is, it's, it's the nerfed version of it. Which means it's it's very, very possible. Yeah, it, it's much more possible than it used to be. It's still like a super annoying level, though. <laughs> like, really annoying. Man, this UFO part, though, is pretty rough. Wow, I mean, that's tough, right? Holy. Holy. Dude, man, this level's hard. Thanks. Oh, my goodness, dude. Oh, what? <laughs> Man, PG Club Step, out of all the levels we've played today, this is 100% my most hated level in the map packs. The stupid face is like, ooh, you lost, ooh, you chose the wrong way, ooh. They drive me up the wall. I just want to like, I've never felt like I want to punch my monitor more than seeing those stupid PG Club Step faces. Like, they make me so angry and i don't know why like you know there's parts in other levels that are like oh loser when you die or whatever and they provoke you like those don't hold a candle to these stupid faces everywhere in pg club step the stupid ooh, just fall down yeah uh <laughs> happy face ooh. i am not doing that in normal mode there's no way Anyways, those are a collection of levels that you guys voted as some of the worst and also the one that I thought uh, being PG Club Step. Uh, what do you guys think? What do you guys think in the comment section? What are the worst levels for you in the map packs? Um, honestly, it's all opinion based. It's all very subjective. Me personally, like most of the levels I played today, I actually really enjoyed. Um, you know, there's parts that are annoying about them. The only level out of the ones I played today that I absolutely despise is PG Club Step. That's it. That's the only one. I hate with the passion. The other ones, I'm like, oh yeah, they have some bad parts. I mean, I guess um, Hyper Ice Jumper because it's so bugged. I, you know, I don't like that. It's kind of annoying that it's like unbeatable. Um, but I guess if something changed in an update, you know, it's it's outside of the control of the creator. Like whatever shit happens. Um, but one level I don't like is PG Club. Ah! 